Space was a busy place in 2022. Beautiful sight to see Falcon Heavy flying once again. This year, SpaceX broke its own record for the most launches, topping 60. CEO Elon Musk wants to hit 100 in 2023. In November, three, two, one. NASA finally launched its SLS rocket for the Artemis 1 mission to the moon. The time for SLS and Artemis 1 has arrived. After multiple delays and problems from hurricanes to hydrogen leaks, we rise together back to the moon and beyond. The Orion capsule on board made it to lunar orbit. It didn't land, but did send back stunning pictures before splashing down. America's new ticket to ride to the moon and beyond now in view. All part of NASA's Artemis program to one day take humans back to the moon for the first time in more than 50 years. We're seeing these galaxies in a way that we've never been able to see before. In July, the long-delayed $10 billion James Webb Space Telescope beamed back its first spectacular pictures of faraway planets and galaxies. These images are going to remind the world that America can do big things. In September, NASA sent a refrigerator-sized spacecraft careening into an asteroid at 14,000 miles an hour, scoring a galactic bullseye. For the first time ever, humanity has changed the orbit of a planetary body. The goal, of course, defending against future potential planet-killing asteroids. If an Earth-threatening asteroid was discovered and we could see it far enough away, this technique could be used to deflect it. In May, private space company Rocket Lab scored its own first, using a helicopter to snag a rocket booster in midair as it floated back to Earth. The invasion of Ukraine triggered a space spat when the head of Russia's space program threatened to withdraw his country from the International Space Station. That sparked a terse Twitter exchange with retired astronaut Scott Kelly. I just felt uh, obligated to point out the fact that if he did that, his space program would really have no reason to exist and would probably go out of business. In orbit, though. Back on the International Space Station. It was business as usual. We have been up here on Space Station for a few days now, and it's been busy. Italian astronaut Samantha Cristoforetti posting where no astronaut had posted before to TikTok. What questions do you have about life on Space Station? Tell me in the comments. And finally on Mars, the Ingenuity helicopter continued record-breaking flights over the Red Planet, ready to lift off again in 2023. Clayton Sandell, Newsy, Denver.